the phrase which came to my mind was actually a Hindi phrase, which was ulta chor kotwal ko dante. If anybody has a complaint, we have a complaint about Canada. You know, what I said earlier, the space that they're giving to Khalistanis and to violent extremists. Let me actually uh, answer it, because I think there's a bigger issue involved. Other than uh, the requirements of World Bank politics, why anybody would do this? And I think it's not good for the relationship, and I think it's not good for Canada. The Canadian NSA's remark. You know, I was, uh, what shall I say? Uh, mm, okay. The phrase which came to my mind was actually a Hindi phrase, which was ulta chor kotwal ko dante. I mean, I have, we, if anybody has a complaint, we have a complaint about Canada. You know, what I said earlier, the space that they are giving to Khalistanis and to violent extremists. So, I, I was very perplexed by what I heard. Uh, you know, uh, for some time now, uh, there, are, uh, there is this case of uh, 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 students uh, who the Canadians say did not study in the college which they should have studied and when they applied for a work permit, they got into difficulties. Uh, from the very start, we, meaning uh, the foreign ministry here as well as the uh, our high commission and the consulates in Canada have taken up that case and our point is that, look, the students studied in good faith, you know. If there were people who misled them, the people who misled them, the culpable parties should be acted against. It is unfair to punish a student who undertook their education uh, in good faith. Uh, so, uh, the latest report that I got, uh, in fact, only this morning was that I think uh, yesterday the Canadian Prime Minister also uh, kind of made a statement uh, in the House of Commons there and uh, the Minister also tweeted uh, something and they have also been talking to our High Commission out there. I think the Canadians also accept that, you know, it would be unfair, I mean, if, this, if a student has done no wrong and, and you know, I, I don't know if all the cases are the same, I mean, there is a granularity about it which sitting at this distance neither you or I can judge. If any, you know, if a student has done no wrong, they accept the idea that, uh, you know, they have to find some uh, solution for it. So we will continue to press, and uh, I would very much hope that the Canadian system uh, is is fair uh, uh, in that regard. Uh, regarding the this float issue used, I let me let me actually uh, answer it because there, I think there's a bigger issue involved. Uh, and the bigger issue involved is really the space that Canada has uh, continuously and frankly uh, to us, uh, you know, uh, we are at a loss to understand other than uh, the requirements of World Bank politics, why anybody would do this? Uh, because if you look at their history, I mean, you would imagine that, that they learn by the history and they wouldn't like to repeat their history. So, so you know, uh, it isn't only one incident, however egregious it may be. I think there is a larger underlying issue about uh, the space which is given to uh, separatists, to extremists, to people who advocate violence. And I think it's not good for the relationship and I think it's not good for Canada.